Hi, today we'll be demonstrating how to get started with FalcorDB Cloud. First, let's navigate to falcordb.cloud and sign up. Once that is completed and our email address is verified, we can log in with our new account. Initially, we'll see two tiers available, free and paid. For this demonstration, we'll use the free tier. Click on subscribe and then dashboard. On the sidebar, you can find the access control section where you can invite and manage members of this subscription. To deploy a new FalcoDB instance, let's navigate to resources, then free. Here, you can see all existing instances, which should be empty for now. Next, let's press create free instance. On the menu that just opened now, let's choose Google Cloud Platform as the cloud provider and any region of your choice. I'll choose US Central 1 for now. Then we can fill in the other parameters, name, description, user, and password. We can also opt in for TLS. Let's leave it at false. After that, we can click create free instance. After a couple of minutes, our instance should have changed the lifecycle status field to running. When that happens, we can click on the deployed instance and navigate to the connectivity tab. Clicking on the View More button for the global endpoint field, we can see the endpoint for the node. We can do the same for the port field to see the port of our instance. We'll use these values to connect to our instance. Next, we can use any FalkorDB client library to connect to our instance. I'll be using Node.js for this demonstration. Filling in host, port, username and password fields will allow us to connect to the instance. And that's it. We have successfully deployed and connected to a FalkorDB instance. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to get in touch with us through our Discord channel.